So, they were doing something a little bit different today. Um, well, for starters, it's Chuseok today. So, uh, Chuseok is a Korean holiday. It's the equivalent to um, uh, Thanksgiving in the States. And uh, yeah, it's pretty dead in this whole uh, everyone tends to go out to the rural parts of Korea and see their um, family or extended families or what have you and yeah so businesses are closed and I do not have family out here anymore. My aunt actually used to live out here and now she moved to Thailand. Uh, this was a long time ago, but yeah, anyways, I don't have family here, long story short. So, what I'm planning to do though today is get a tattoo. So that'll be interesting. I don't think I can film there knowing how or that tattoos are illegal in Korea, but I don't know, we shall see. But honestly, I feel like I'm yelling right now. It is so dead around here I think the vegan bakery is open right now so uh, hopefully I hope it is because I need me some cream button right now before I get stabbed in my finger Ugh, they're not open I could have sworn they said they'd be open but that could have just been my imagination of what I wanted to hear but actually it's the complete opposite I'm gonna stop at 7 Eleven and see what I can get here because I'm pretty hungry. Yeah, so. Okay, so this is what I got. It looks pretty sad, but I mean, <laughs> it'll do. I had two bananas this morning, but you can never have too much bananas. And I got the Almond Breeze chocolate this time. I got the um, banana one yesterday and it was okay. And then the bananas were 18,000 or 1,800, <laughs> 18,000, 1,800. So 3,000 total. Yeah, too bad, I guess. Lunch. Okay, the chocolate one is so much better. Just, just letting you know. I mean, we have these in the states pretty much, but banana. I was excited to try, but it was okay. This is so really good. <laughs> I found about the tattoo shop. I'm at a coffee bean right now and then me and my friend just kind of looked across the way and we just saw a bunch of tatted people hanging out over there and then we walked past here and it said there is a sign for tattoos. Oh there it is. Uh, it's short for a yellow monkey but yeah. Um, this is my tattoo. I'm going to sun for a few hours and I'm just waiting for Tara to get here. She's not here yet. And I've been waiting. <laughs> for a while and I really want to get hot dog again. Should I do it guys? Should I do it? I really should. Oh and I wanted to show you my earrings. How crazy that is. It's like floating on my ear. Style Nanda. Ooh that's where I should go today. Oh wow I really should. I just spent money on a tattoo. Wow. I'm so broke. I uh it, it went by quick obviously it's a small tattoo. It didn't well I lied if I say it didn't hurt. It hurt. Actually, it hurt really bad. It was like tolerable at the beginning, and then as it just kept progressing, I mean, it only took like 10 minutes, probably less, no, 10 minutes. And uh, yeah, finger tattoos hurt. So if you want to get finger tattoo, just be warned. They hurt. But I think tattoos hurt. I hate when people say, like, oh, it tickles. It doesn't tickle. It really doesn't. And if it tickles, 
I want your kind of tolerance. Oh. Hey. <laughs> wow, this late ass. Wait, what time is it? 8.48? 8.48? Yeah, you said 3.30. Say hi to the vlog. Since someone created my YouTube channel already. Okay, we are going to where? Huggers! Huggers! It's a vegan, uh, God, it would help if my face was in there. It's a vegan, vegan burger shop and I'm really hungry. I want fries. Very hungry. I like how you're you're like very accepting of the camera. People are just like people are just like, but you're all up on like, get my good side. <laughs> but we're in Itaewon. Whoa! Look at that thing. What's he doing? Uh. <laughs> Sure. Yeah. <laughs> okay, definitely not this way before, but holy shit. Do you see this hill? Ooh, look at the view. Uh, picture. Yes, picture. Okay, I have a vlog. Fine. Yeah. We just come here every morning just to remind yourself, like, this is okay. Oh. Wow. <gasps> Open on Chuseok. Vegan, vegan burgers all day. <laughs> What did you get? Yeah. Same. Man, you can see like the pesto like <laughs> seeping out. I know, it looks really good. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, don't really I don't think people can normally put this in their mouth. No, I like cut mine in half last time. I feel like I might have to do that. I'm gonna try like I actually don't know how to make vegan cheese. Do you guys? But supposedly it's not that. Not that bad. This is like the best burger I've had. Oh like vegan burger that I've had. Oh, look at yours. Like you can really see like yours. Damn. It's really good. This fool couldn't wait. I had to take my pictures, but someone wanted to get into the ice cream, right? Mm -hmm. But this is where you have to do it. It's not like ice cream to me. It's more like I see. That meal was lit. Yeah, I know for real. <laughs> Tato, wait, wait, wait. What did you say to the, the man after you had your burger? Say bye. <laughs> and then like the was it the Ajima that turned around and she's like No, just the, the younger one. Oh my god. She immediately just like turned around. I told her what Taebak meant. And just like ignored me. Yeah, I, I didn't, but I didn't explain like yeah. the context of. Someone did not explain it. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it's it's uplifting because I'm climbing a bunch of hills right now, so it's it makes me feel. Okay, this is what I hate. Oh my god! Oh my! God. That got really. <laughs> yeah, you know, I'm really scared. I am not okay. We about to die. <laughs> no, that's literally how it is here. Like, yeah. I feel like I'm constantly like dodging someone. Like, the car, but Ajima. <laughs> it's kind of like, yo. Me yeah, exactly. Yo, Ajima's and the best are just the same. Like, that's like, they're on the same level. Which is sad. But what's even more sad, we have to go down this right now. Yeah. Without, actually, that, this one isn't that, that bad. One was worse. Yeah, the other one was really steep. Yeah. God, Itaewon, man, yeah. chill out. Look, this is how I'm walking. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, is that, is that how you're walking? No, no. Or is that just me? Yeah, that just <laughs> it doesn't. It looks more painful than like walking normally. It looks more. It looks weirder too because I have mom jeans on, so I just look like this like stumpy like person just kind of walking with my legs spread. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Well, Taebok. Like yeah. Yeah, go sideways. That's the smart way. This one's scary. This is so steep. I feel like I shouldn't be vlogging while I'm doing this, but... Yeah, this is... I know. I know. I'm just like, wait, should I even be doing this right now? Because I might break a neck. A neck. My one only neck. My one... <laughs> 
So Tata is buying the shirt and I really want it too. <laughs> but she got the color I wanted, but she saw it first, so she's entitled to it. But look how cool it is. It's so cool. She got it gray. Gray is like the best one, I think. I don't know what this is, but it looks really cool. Like, I feel like a lot of these places in Korea are so visually appealing. Mm -hmm. Look, look. Yeah, that's true. It's like something has to fill these alleyways. No, but look how cute this is. Whoa. My friend was saying how, like, you say one's like the new hipster. After wandering for, I don't even know how long we're wandering for. After talking, but good talks. Good talks. Good talks. We finally made it to kind of civilization, kind of. We still have no idea where we are. Now it's like way down, way down. I know. This is a cool stop though, I like this. <laughs> you chill? <laughs> Look, she has the right idea too. I just got home. It was a long day today, but a good day. A good day, nonetheless. Um, here's a closer look at my tattoo i feel like though you know i've ha i have finger tattoos i have them on my other hand and um i know what it looks like when you know tattoos are healing and this one just seems very off to me like it doesn't seem raised or swollen or anything like it just kind of looks like it's a sticker like on my finger and I don't know, I haven't had a small tattoo in a while. My last small tattoo is on my left hand and it's a finger tattoo. I have got that like a year ago, probably over a year and a half ago. So I don't quite remember the healing process. Um, I know it rarely peeled, but I'm, I'm interested to see how this will heal. I really hope it stays because I know there's a chance that of it um, not staying just because, you know, of the placement. But I actually like how he placed it. Because how I wanted it, it I probably wouldn't have liked it if he didn't place it like this. My, my camera is literally placed on top of toilet paper roll right now. Just to kind of talk about um, the Korean tattoo shop that I was at, it's called YNM. It is in Hongdae. So I sat with the artist and I was already talking to him prior to my sitting, which was on Kao Kao. Uh, I mean, it's not like I got a big tattoo, but just to kind of tell you about the, the, tattoo, the tattoo experience, uh, I got tattooed by Hyungi. 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 So, and he was a really nice guy. And I even told him, like I text him in Korean and like, hey, like, um, I don't speak English well, um, or I don't speak English well. True, I don't speak Korean well, but I want to get a text tattoo, pretty much. And ever after that, he was just trying to speak to me in um, really broken English. But I mean, it was really nice of him. I still kept up the conversation in Korean, but he was just being very considerate that I couldn't speak it well, so. He was speaking um, back to me in English. But anyways, really nice guy, he was really cool. And yeah, so he sat down with me. Um, and there's, it's really cool, they had like a computer screen there. He typed out the text of what I wanted and then so I can see it. And he was just making adjustments. And uh, it was interesting because, you know, tattoos in Korea are technically illegal, but it's a lot more relaxed. And I paid before actually paid before and I've never done that before so I thought that was interesting and I was just like I don't know how I felt about that but I did it anyway then I was called in he opened all the packages um the packaging for the needle in front of me so I can see that it was sterile yeah he made sure the placement was what I wanted and we let the stencil dry and then yeah he stabbed me with a bunch of needles for about 10 minutes it was really quick obviously it's small and it's on my finger. The pain level, obviously, is a finger tattoo. It hurts. Um, but, you know, you just kind of have to do it with tattoos. It's 
gonna be over anyway sooner or later but uh it was interesting to see um the difference of what they do uh tattoo shops in korea as opposed to i mean granted each tattoo shop's different but this is definitely um a different experience for me i really enjoyed it though uh, i had a good time and yeah it's really cool i recommend him I'll link his Instagram in the description. He does really good work. By the way, if you don't know what uh, this means, himne means like be strong. That's how I translate it to. It has uh, a lot of meanings. Like um, I know Sonoshide has a song out. It's called himne, and they translate it to cheer up. I have it facing me for a reason because it's a reminder to myself. Um, yeah, I know t uh, tattoos typically they face you know the other way so the you know they can other people can see them and what they are. But this one's personal. And it's for me, and I feel like this has um, a more personal meaning. And the fact that I can get in Korea while you know like doing this. Um, going through this experience really means a lot to me so i really wanted to get a tattoo out here and specifically this one uh, let me know down in the comments below if you want to see more vlogs in korea and yeah